everybody. I am back with my Color CL uh, review. This is for their Ultra Moist line. This is most of the Ultra Moist. Um, I had already reviewed two of them and uh, so I won't add those in today just because I reviewed them in my last Color CL video and I want to be able to share the ones that I have not shared before. This is the first pair and I had been trying to get my hands on these, so I'm very, very, very happy to have them this time to be able to show you guys. Um, again, like I said in my last video, um, Josh and I came down with COVID. We caught COVID. He caught it from work, brought it home, and I got sick. Um, I am vaccinated, but it didn't lessen any of my symptoms or my sickness. I struggle to breathe, and I've got liver damage. Um, got blood tests done at the doctors, uh, and my iron is critically, critically low. Um, they did not give me a transfusion, which they should have. You're supposed to have one if your blood is under, or your iron is under seven, minus four. Um, I don't have iron pills, so I haven't had them for a month, and, uh, yeah, it's just a mess. Um, and it makes me really short of breath and lightheaded to talk a lot so like I did in my Dr. Lee video um, DTLI um, I'm not gonna talk very much during this I'm just gonna show you the lenses in order from my most favorite to least favorite as I do and tell you what they're called and just let you guys enjoy um, as always the color seal great quality beautiful lenses nice tight pupil hole great blending around the pupil very realistic very comfortable and um, I just wanted to thank them for not only their patience with me while I've been sick but also for sending me these lenses to review because um, it's the first line that's come out in a while since the Sahara and I, I really really wanted to be able to review these and so they're very kind uh, to send me these and let me review them for you so Let's get started, and these are Almond Blossom. And I'm also struggling to find the right light source because I feel very, very sick and gross, and I don't really want the light on me. I am only doing these videos because it's been long enough, and I really want to do the right thing and do these reviews for these companies that have trusted me with their products. Um, but I feel incredibly ugly, uglier than usual. And so I don't have the light right on my face and I'm probably making it worse on myself. I only want to give enough light to show the lenses. So I apologize if the lighting is really weird and not quite right today, but hopefully you guys can still see. And even if, it doesn't show up as well in my eyes as always I show them in the case so you can see what they look like off of the human eye because of course your eye color will change the way the lenses look on you all right I'm not sure how to say this one um, Patagonia, I think. Uh, that'll be reversed. But uh, something like that. Anyway, I'll put it here. Love these. I was the almond blossom, and these were two that I desperately wanted to try last time, and I wasn't able to get them, so they did not disappoint. These are Pittsburgh. This is Vienna. 
green when you put it on with a yellow tinge very yellow in the container absolutely love this color super natural my real color to compare huge fan of these These are Seville, Seville, I don't know how to pronounce these, I'll put the name, very natural, gorgeous, very close to my actual eye color, but better. London. These are Tulaos, Tulaos, Tulu. I don't, I'm not even going to try to pronounce these. They're going to be in right there. These are also a very natural looking color. And in the package, quite red on my eye, brown, brownish. Still prettier than mine. They're like an orangish color. Great for Halloween. Very, very nice. These last two are very different in shape. This is just called green. And as you will see, when I show you in the case, it's got like a half moon shape to it uh, on the inside. It's, it's very different, but on the eye, it doesn't look noticeable. It looks very realistic, as Color CL usually does. <laughs> And lastly, these are just called brown, or at least that's what it says on the package that I have. And these are virtually indistinguishable from my natural eye, so I cannot say I like these too much because it's pointless to wear them because they look just like my eye color, almost exactly. So um, for someone else, these might be great. For me, not so much. They do look realistic though, but that's the end of this video. Um, I'm going to try to come back with a video talking more about health and weight and things that I've wanted to talk about when I feel better and can just blab without running out of breath. So hopefully if you guys are still around, I will see you soon. Not many people are around anymore on my channel, which is understandable because I'm not really here myself. And I'm not here because nobody else is here and nobody else is here because I'm not here so it's a vicious cycle but it's my fault <laughs> anyway thank you for watching if you've been here thank you so much for color CL to color CL uh, for making these wonderful lenses and again for giving me the opportunity to test them out and I am so sorry that I've taken so long to review these and um, detail detailize lenses um, but I hope to see you guys around and take care. Let me know 
if you like these and if you've bought any, what you think, what are your favorites. I did mine most favorite to least favorite as I always do. Um, these are only not my favorite top or higher because they look like my eyes, but I will see you guys around. Take care. I miss you guys. Stay safe and stay healthy. Bye.